Hey everybody, it's Bill Tucker with the CCAR Tech Committee. I'm here to give you a quick overview of Pen Ultimate. It's not intended to be a detailed tutorial, just a quick overview. If you're one of those people that likes to take handwritten notes, then this is the perfect app for you. Um, it's easy, quick, and it's free. You just download it from the App Store, download it right to your app, iPad, and when you open it up, you're going to get what looks like a notebook. And just tap on the notebook to open it up. Then I'm going to tap again to make the page larger, and you'll see that there are some icons at the top of the page. I'll tap on the pen icon, and that gives me choices of ink color, and it also lets me, lets me adjust the stroke of the pen, whether I want it broad or thin. I'm going to choose the blue ink with the, with the thinnest uh, tip on the pen, and then I can just write like I normally would write, just on a piece of paper, just like that. And if I've made a mistake and I need to erase part of what I wrote, I just tap on the eraser icon and just do that with my stylus and it disappears just like with a pencil eraser. Then I can tap on the pen icon again and rewrite whatever I want to put on the paper. If I've decided that part of what I wrote I'd like to move to a different part of the page, I can tap on the scissor icon, just circle the part I want to move tap inside the circle, tap on cut, tap at a different part of the page where you see the word paste, and there you go. I've moved it just like that. And then if I want to go back up here, I can just type on the page and continue to write. If it looks like I've made a total mess of this and I want to erase the whole page, I just click on the icon that looks like the trash can and it says clear page, and it clears my page, and I can start over. Once I've made notes, if I'd like to send a copy of my notes to somebody, I can tap on the arrow icon and I can send by text message or email. And if I need to start a new notebook, I can tap and go back to the home page and tap at the bottom of the page to create a new notebook. I can tap like that and I'm closing it and then I've got another notebook if I want to start a new notebook. Quick and easy. Uh, intuitive app that won't be hard to use. I encourage you to download it and play with it.